I you probably hear because you still have a issue with your with your Renault Zoe. Most probably version R90, R110, or R130. Uh, yes, I had the same issue with mine. Um, the method you have to apply is different to reset the fault. Let's um, restart from zero. You have the system and fault. And when you with the ODB reader, you get this fault, P463, to have more the water pump. On Renault Zoe, water pump um, is supposed to be replaced every 10,000 hours. That's up to you to replace it or not. It's quite expensive. It's something like 1,000 euro, a bit less maybe. And uh, a lot of people do not replace it. And it seems to be fine. That's my case as well. So you try method one on my other video. You try to reset the counter, but it didn't work, so um, you have to switch to this method. Unfortunately, you st you're you going to have to buy a new dongle. Okay, let's go on uh, AliExpress. That's where I found the right dongle. You need a specific dongle from Conway. So you can you just type in on AliExpress Conway ELM327 version 1.5. This is quite classic dongle um, which communicate with uh, Bluetooth. It works fine. Uh, I tried it on Android uh, smartphone. My first uh, on first phone it wasn't able to connect. I used um, it was a Google phone, Pixel a Pixel from Google, but with another one it worked fine. Then once you receive it, we're gonna plug it to the to, your, to the car. Directly on the plug. Once the dongle is connected, you're going to have to go on your smartphone. Uh, connect to your smartphone previously your uh, dongle should be should be quite easy. And um, then we are going to need, um, sorry, it's a French app, I don't know if it's an English version. Um, it's called EODB Facile. I'll uh, have a look to my uh, screen, it's going to be easy to compile this. Uh, this app costs something like 20 euros, but it worth it. Okay, install the app. Then you're gonna have to uh, give some authorization, select dongle, Bluetooth dongle. Then you're gonna have to select the dongle and the car if you want to connect to give some authorization. Okay, we have Conway, connect. Select your car. We know Zoe, select the right version you have. Then you can uh, scan only EVC, that's a um, chip you want, we want to connect, we don't care about the other ones. It's going to take a while to scan, so directly switch to the next step. Then you have to go on the bottom and select uh, console or maybe an English command. It will require uh, a license, I think. That's where you are going to have to pay 20 euros. Go for it, don't worry. It works. Then you have to specifically type in this code. This code reset each counter, so you have four different codes to select. To type in and just validate, it's not, and you should get exactly this reply from the, uh, the chip. If you do not have this uh, response, it means it didn't work. At the end, for the last one, you should have um, directly your light, your fault light goes off. 
that's what happened on mine. I didn't have to do anything else. I hope it worked for you. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me a comment or uh, thanks. It makes me happy. And um, yeah, if you, uh, if you have any comments or questions, I will try to answer it quickly. Bye-bye.